Let's play. Josh Cal here with more Blue Dragon. Okay, so, um, this is a really interesting intro. <laughs> we're down at the bottom part of the cave in, uh, that we were in last part, and, uh, I got that part off screen, and I'll uh, show that off later, but when I went to the middle, I got ambushed by, like, six of these guys, and I instantly caught them in my thing, so I'm gonna have my fun with these six. <laughs> That's some good SP and experience too. Yeah, sure. <laughs> okay, so um, the item I picked up was from that chest in the upper level there. Uh, where are we? Oh, there it is, right there. <laughs> Mystery part un. So um, this is one of the three items you need to craft the best necklace in the game, which you can only have one of. So, uh, equip it wisely, <laughs> because you can totally still re-equip it to someone else, so it's not like it matters. Alright, so I'm gonna meet you back, um, in the room where we fought Gilala. We have no time to waste. Wait, what? <laughs> oh, that's the door I went in, okay, so I, the game won't even let you go back. And I'm pretty sure I know why, because as soon as we leave G Lala's house, yeah, that's right, this actually leads to G Lala's house. So that's how he got here so quickly, anyway. Yeah, so anyway, after we leave uh, Old Me's Manor, excuse me, we will do a cutscene, so that's why I won't let you go out that way, because uh, you'd be bypassing that. Sort of, anyway. No, how was I supposed to know which way is which? This is his room. G -la -la's manor. G -la -la's room. Gee, uh, maybe it's someone else's room. He s seems like such a, you know, selfless guy. He'd uh, help some other people. No, it's his room. He's an asshole. Surah, surah. Guru Guru is innocent. Huh? And don't you worry. We're gonna bring him home. I knew he was innocent. Please bring him back. You're really going to help Guru Guru? Take this with you then. Grand Tribe's necklace, alright. I will wait here as long as it takes. Please help Guru Guru. Join. Okay, so well, the Grand Tribe's is just as good as um the bracelet Shu currently have has equipped, then I would assume it's a pretty good necklace, but everyone had everyone had literally except my remote has like the same one. <laughs> uh, I suppose she needs its defense. Yes, she does. I'll take that. Restores about 10 HP when defending. That's an interesting ability. Okay, so um we have to we now have to go back to that uh cave where Guru Guru is uh in captivity. You're not he's not really it's he can kind of just walk out any time, so I guess he was staying there by his own free will. Um such a smart, not, such a nice guy, but he's pretty stupid. To some extent, anyway. Okay, so I'm just gonna cut to when we get there. Oh, this is looking much more brighter than it was last time we came here, that's for sure. And we can just go right in. Yeah, so there's nothing, you know, no ominous voice going, Ooh, you can't come in, it's poisonous. So let's just go straight in. Um, Yeah, really small. If you thought, like, the other cave thing was small, get a load of how big this one is. It's one path to a metal there, only one metal, so useful. There's a path this way that has two of these guys. Now, we've seen guys that look like this before in, um, um, Forest of the Dead and the uh, Gull Mountains. But this is a new variety. These ones, um, poison you, I assume. <laughs> because, uh, they are called Poison Mist. Gee, they're all gonna get a turn before he's going to even get to use that. Oh well. Not like they do that much damage individually. Especially when they're defending. Yeah, these guys are weak for a reason, which you'll see in a couple more enemies. Man, that guy has the best dance move. Too bad you use it on someone who doesn't use magic power. Let's uh let's see how much we can do with this grounder. There's no charge. 
Yeah, just we can still kill everyone with that. Well, you feel pretty silly, don't you now, Moro Moro, just charging up the whole thing when you didn't need to, because Luke was just gonna kick the crap out of him. All right, what do you get? Critical hit lift. Uh, not that great. I like what he's got equipped better. So there's a second one on the way. I'll take care of him. Okay, that's that done now. Just around the corner here is the end. Wow, that was sure long, wasn't it? That was so long, I think I might collapse from exhaustion. Exhaustion, ex exhaust, sh ugh, that's a weird. It's like, I, I know what the word is, but I can't say it today for some reason. <laughs> exhaustion. It's like, I, I feel like I'm saying it wrong. What is this? This man is good who do The mist. He's surrounded by cursed mist. What can we do to help him? The only thing we can do is try and get rid of it. We should definitely use magic. This is a boss? Uh, alright, this is a boss, I guess. So, I guess Guru Guru is just like some kind of Super Saiyan 3 Piccolo. That's what he kind of looks like. <laughs> so they're still doing this. So, yeah, the goal isn't actually to hurt Guru Guru. You've got to kill all the guys around him. Now, uh, you may think I wouldn't want to use ground because that'd hit him too. Well, you'd maybe be wrong because um, he's poisoned, as you can see, and he can actually take quite a bit of damage before he dies. So you'll probably want to do that. But as you can see, we don't really freaking need to because these guys are super weak and we can take them on one by one like this. Ow. Who was that? That was Zola? No, I don't know. Yeah, all I need to do is, like, Flara the back one. And we're good. And that's that done already. Some boss. Let's bring him home. But he looks kind of heavy. Hurry! Give me a hand! Jiro now complains about people being too heavy. Can't you just use your shadow to pick him up? Is it really you, Sarasara? <laughs> hey, Guru Guru, do you remember us? We're the ones you asked to deliver the message to Sarasara. You are the ones. Thank you so much. Everything that happened was Jilala's doing. See, the gem is still in one piece. How? Then I'm no longer... That's right. You can stay here now. Sarasara, I can stay here with you? I don't know how to thank you. Oh, don't worry about it. It was no big deal. I'm so happy for the two of you. We wish you the best. This is yours. Ah. We must be on our way. The Gorgo tribe will continue to be friends with Gibral. Have no worries. Thank you. Thank you so much. Okay, see you around. <laughs> That's kind of funny when you think about it. It's like... That operation to destroy Nene's ship thing wouldn't have worked without those giant Gorgos. 
or Gorgos, however you want to pronounce that. So it's like, mmm. <laughs> I can't imagine them going, hmm, you destroyed my precious gem, mmm. Even though you supply us with these giants for our army, I don't like you anymore, go away, ha ha ha. <laughs> so stupid. Gibral aren't mean like that, man. You don't have to worry. So now we've got plenty of gold to buy the rest of our spells here. Not that we're going to use them because they're kind of useless support magic, but still. Buy them all! Buy them all! Buy them all! Okay, so that's that done. Um, So now that we've gone like in and out of like an area, we can now talk to... Um... Is it Saru Saru or Guru Guru? One of them. Talk to one of them in the middle and they'll give you the thing. Dude, let me fucking pass. <laughs> they'll give you the um, thing that Zola just had. Because apparently they don't even want it. That's how much they care about it. <laughs> so stupid. I can feel Guru Guru's love for me, but my love for him is just as strong. And your bravery and, bravery and dedication is just as strong. Thank you so much. So very much. Ooh. Thank you for coming, our little friends. Since you got this jewel back for us, you should be the ones to have it. I hope this helps you. That is what we... That is that is what all we wish. That is one weird structured, sen structured sentence game. Gemma Draw. Okay, yeah. I, I, I'm sucking at reading today. I don't really get that. Maybe my brain just doesn't like... It's like, I ain't, I ain't activating today, you stupid tool bag. So the Gem of Gibral gives 20 magic attacks, so we would want to equip that to Klukrat. Well, um, maybe. In fact, I think we definitely do. But definitely better than uh, whatever she had before, I don't remember. Bowtie, that's not that great. Okay, um, so there's not really much to do here, but before we leave, we may as well, um, Gee, those, those guys really wanted to watch that chick dance. I, I got that chest last time. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not hiding anything. Um, <laughs> what happened was um, I forgot to save, so I kind of had to redo everything I redid last episode because I'm a smart guy. <laughs> Gee, I can't even see the freaking door. <laughs> it's too dark. Yeah, so let's go see that ch dancing chick that um those two Gorgos were excited about. Clearly, a master dancer. <laughs> I'm bored already. <laughs> so this is an inn as well, so uh, we can take like a nap. We should get rid of Zola's like poison too, anyway. Yes. Skip. Ah, quick as piss. Not that pissing is that quick, but whatever. <laughs> oh yeah, this is so great. What do these guys think? Gilala was captured, but I still have Kururin. Aren't you amazing? <laughs> Gilala is gone. I want Kururin as my master. <laughs> Kinky. As long as we have Kururin, that's all that matters. Apparently, you don't need to be fed or anything. I still think Kururin is the best. Or is best. Yep, these guys love this chick dancing. I want Guru Guru to be happy. Well, oh, this is like the one sensible guy in the building. He's like, yeah, I don't care about this chick. I'm happy about Guru Guru. Can't you can't actually get up here, so I can't like talk to her or anything. I I would think she likes the attention she's getting though. <laughs> I would think so anyway. And with that done, we're pretty much ready to leave the village. Uh, yeah. <laughs> so, uh, I think we'll, that'll pretty much be it for this episode. So, um, actually, you know, I was, it's going to be just faster to outright warp to Gibral Castle than to walk back through all that crap. <laughs> so let's do that while I end the episode. Ah, oh, multitasking. <laughs> so thanks for watching. Next episode, we'll finally go the way we're supposed to go and go north. And see what the hell... Well, what are we even doing? Destroying ancient machines. That's about right. Hello, I'm Little Meg from Cafe Gibral. The Cafe Gibral is a buzz with new gossip. You... No, I don't want to get warped to the cafe. That's... Could actually save you some time. Not, probably not, actually. Anyway, thanks for watching. See you next time.